Hey everybody, Nostalgia Scott coming to you guys with part 4 of Yu-Gi-Oh! Ultimate Masters. Uh, so, for the, um, pretty much, I believe, for Goblin King and Ojama Yellow to show up in Tier 2, we actually have to beat each of these guys three times. So, let's take on Skull Servant. So, we got a lot of duels ahead of us. Oh, we actually went second. Oh, yeah, give me all the spell and trap cards. I'm not complaining, but come on. Oh, Mystical Beast Service. Just for a lot of these guys, we really have to, you know, go all out on. Just because they have so many defensive spell and trap cards, it's insane. I don't think Skull Servant gave us much of an issue, though, last time. Well, it is when he goes for Heavy Storm. And Pot of Greed. And Foolish Burial. Well, you know what? I'm going to activate my own Heavy Storm on you. Because, you know, you're just a dick. That's all you are. And call the Haunted for your weak-ass Skull Servant. So, we're going to attack whatever that face down may be. King of the Skull Servants. It can summon itself back to the field by removing from play Skull Servants. It's a decent card, but with only one Skull Servant in the graveyard, it's kind of... Lightning Vortex? Really? Oh my god, Jeep is this. Well, we can now summon Rapid Fire Magician. I'm gonna keep my card face down because I want the abilities to activate. Well, the ability to, you know, get my new card. And you cannot bring him back, so luckily for us, we're done with that King of the Skull Servants. Come on with that! Oh my god. Alright. Special summoning you. Remove you from play. Remove you from play. Summon you in attack mode. It's actually the first... Yeah, and you can remove from play cards, I believe, instead of attacking. Well, monsters. Wait, there's no monster to remove from play on his side of the field, so why bother, right? No point at all. Alright. I kind of wish these duels would go by a little faster, just due to the fact that, um, you know, we have a lot to do. Uh, once per turn during the main phase, you can, uh, move one face-up monster. Okay, can't attack. Okay, so it's only face-up. So it'd be himself, then. That'd be crappy. Ah, Des Lakuta. Ah, uh, that thing, you have to flip it every turn, and if it does, if you do successfully, you do get to draw a card. Just nice. This guy doesn't have any tough monsters. He's literally just all weak zombies. He hasn't even attacked me with anything yet. Wow, so I think that's... No, I didn't want to continue. I think this card is going to win us the duel. At least at this rate. Wow, another face down, but face downs aren't doing anything to me so far. Spell Shield Type 8. Not a bad card. Maybe he'll attack into it with like Mystical Space Typhoon or something. Only 1100. Pretty much any monster other than our flip effect monsters like Magician of Faith, um, Apprentice Magician, and Old Vindictive Magician can, you know, win it for us. Like, God damn it. Like, I have nothing to just, like, attack directly. So we're gonna have to attack this monster, which is a Spirit Reaper. Poo. Spirit Reaper is automatically destroyed if targeted by a spell trap card, though. Next to be lo what? Why? Why would you Why did you do that to yourself, you idiot? It's meant for your skull servants. I'm fine with that, but come on. Well, might as well summon Chaos Command Magician then. Goodbye. Activate the effect of a car. Oh wait, no, it's just my dude. I always forget that. I always have something on the field when that happens. And we have Stealth Bird. I guess he does have something decent in his deck. And there we go, another victory. Beating Skull Servant a second time. Whoa, 856 bucks. Let's fight him again. And he goes second again, really? 
I don't know, I really gotta get rid of the, um, the, like, Hikaru and Kuron. They're just not very, very good card. Why did you give it to me again? I only have one in the deck. Why give it to me twice? You shuffle bad, game. Goblin zombie, okay. You're just gonna hurt yourself. Blade when it's destroyed, you can do something with a zombie. I'm pretty sure that's how it works. Oh, Dark Magician, that's not bad. Activate! Gravity Bind and Call the Haunted. Oh yeah, if you get three spell counters on this, you get to draw a card, so that's also another cool little feature. What I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna use that as bait. And we'll set that face down to, you know, see if he attacks into it. But we do have enough attack points to destroy Goblin Zombie. Kinda cool that he has Goblin Zombie. You're yeah, just gonna add another one to his hand. A cards are normally broken when it doesn't say that you can't add itself. And ooh, face downs, yay! Your opponent's about to. Oh, wait, yeah, I forgot what card I have face down. <laughs> Apprentice Magician, ooh. No. 800 light points is, is fine t for me, man. Also, just set you face down, because I'm pretty sure this is gonna be like Goblin Zombie or something, right? Or like Skull Servant? A Goblin Zombie, exactly. Ah, Des Lakuta. I never thought the White Magician Picaroo would actually do something good. <laughs> okay, once again, nothing. Call the Haunted? I'm fine with Call the Haunted as well. And 1200 life points. We're now at 10,000. If you guys can hear some smacking in the background, it's my blinds. They keep, you know, hitting stuff, and it's very annoying, but... This, it blocks the sun from blinding me while recording at this time of day. And our card is just a Skull Servant. Okay. This is going really easily. It wasn't even the Desilakuda. I guess that's because he's trying to build up his King of the Skull Servants. Ah, level limit. I, I don't have a fate. No, I don't have anything for that. Okay. Hmm. Ah, whatever, dude. Another one? Okay. I'm fine with that too, but... And the fact is that my monster, you know, is actually level 3, right? Level 3? No, level 2 means I always get to attack. Ah, it's Spirit Reaper this time, okay. Can't get through this time. But we have a pretty solid, uh, field going on here. Not the ball... God damn it. No! Oh wait, no, I don't want to bother with that anyway. Yeah, I'm gonna activate it now. Wait, no, not that. Oh, I can't activate that. It's only face-ups, I guess. Rapid Fire Magician, eh? I guess we'll summon you, but you'll go to defense mode anyway. But then, I'll just destroy him. To destroy Spirit Reaper, because Spirit... God damn it, it did work, but shoot, that's not what I wanted to do. You're going to defense mode anyway. And destroy the Spear Reaper. But then we'll actually activate Call the Haunted on our little magician here, because guess what? She's actually useful. Well, unless Mystical Space definitely hits the field. Shoot. Well, you can at least special summon you. Uh, yeah, get rid of the library. Library's not useful. And just you. No, you're not gonna destroy your own cards, dude. <sighs> we need something... Something to either destroy that, or... Breaker! Just in the nick of time, buddy. See, this guy is literally just time-delaying. It's not even good. Activate ability. Destroy it. Now, you can go to attack mode. Don't activate your goddamn ability. I don't want to die to you. Die to my own card, you know? Uh, actually, yeah, you can attack because you're not that strong. 
has Lakuda. And you can attack. It's another Spear Reaper, so I'm actually gonna have to use them. Because apparently a lot of these really good cards aren't banned in this yet. There are some, um, really weird bannings in this game. There are actually ways to unlock the other bannings, too. Attack mode. You're gonna have to act actually activate your ability, though. I know we won't get to attack with you, but get rid of it. And then we'll just attack with everyone else. Breaker, attack! As long as it's not Mirror Force. Now we'll attack with Rapid Fire. And lastly, our King of Mean Dark Magician. And now it's then turn. I'm pretty sure there's not much he can do to stop us. Nope, he doesn't even have a monster. And we have Lightning Vortex for backup, so... This duel is ours. You know what, Dark Magician? DARK MAGIC ATTACK! DESTROY HIM! Here we go. That's three wins on him. Excellent. Now, Wadapon, you! Always give me a run for my money. You know what? Go, go first. I don't care. When I seem to go second, I seem to do better. And Gemini Elf, always forget that she's in here. This is our second time drawing her. Mystical Space Typhoon? Heavy Storm? Magical Blast. Really? You know what, Gemini Elf, you're expendable just because you just, you know, have no effect. While Skill Dark Magician actually does have an effect. Kinda figured you'd have something like that. Yeah, God damn it, he sells another card. Or maybe we'll lure him out with Spell Absorption. Nope, it's nothing, so... Skill Dark Magician. I just wanted to see. I know I wasted getting a spell counter, but I just wanted to see. Apparently it wasn't anything that powerful. Stars are revealing light. Okay. Give me back my life points. Thank you. I'm, I'm fine with that. Um, hmm. I'll summon you. It'll activate Magical Blast! There we go. Oh, this is beautiful. Like, look at this. Okay, now I'll activate this. On Rapid Fire. And now we'll sacrifice him. To summon our Dark Magician. Funny thing is, we also have Premature Burial and things like Call the Haunted, which we never seem to draw very often, because they clearly they would help, but... Oh, well. Let's see what you got now. Snatch Steel! Oh, God damn it! Wait, that's not stronger than my card, is it? No, I'm pretty sure he's not stronger, but whatever. Ha! Ah, my own swords are revealing light! Yeah, see, I'm at 26. I don't know what he's going on about, but... Here's my own swords revealing light. Haha! <laughs> oh, man, the light point gain and the light point burn is just so real in this episode. Okay. Oh, yeah. Magical Blast, I really don't want you to come back. Not right now. Ooh! I can destroy Snatch Steel with my own little buddy here. Break him! Break him a new one, little buddy. Also, these guys use a lot of the old shit, so we see a lot of Snatch Steel. Man, Battery Man was like the easiest opponent to take down three times. Like, seriously. Yeah, you lost all your protection and all your stack. Ah, you... oh, man! Now Sanctuary in the sky. Still can't defeat any of my car. You can destroy two of them, apparently. Ah, uh, Jesus. And this is gonna go back to his hand, so... Bummer. No, I don't want you. Eradicator? Yes! 
special summon our main card for once. Sweet. Who is this face down? Ah, Silent Swordsman. It's all purity and light, okay. Dude, I don't want to activate that. Nightmare's still a cage if shit gets rough. You know, when shit hits the fan. Goodbye! And so he's literally just summoning monsters. Wait, are you enough to defeat her as a 12? Damn it, 1600. I don't know, maybe I can weed something out to going into attack mode? Ah, that was just a Zora Priest. No, we didn't weed anything out, but that's a bummer. Ah, we can use our own Nobleman of Crossout, however. So let's get rid of this fool. Oh, it was Marshmallow, actually. Every time we activate a spell card, though, we do a thousand points of damage to the opponent, which is great for us. Okay. Right. You know what? Ah, uh, no, we'll wait for the ending, you know? Oh, you. Damn it, we can't actually use you. What does this do? It's return, right? You know that? So I can confirm this health field during this turn. Are not activated. Okay. Designate one monster, okay. This might actually benefit. Now we can activate this ability to draw a card. And now we can summon you. Well that doesn't really matter because I don't believe he's allowed to attack. Nope. But None of these guys should have their effects activated. So Sangan? Yeah, see Sangan doesn't have an effect, and neither will you. See? Perfect! Diffusion Wave Motion actually benefited us. I did not know it did that. Okay. Oh, we destroyed my Blast Magician. I am shaking in my boots. No. Gob haunted, okay. I can bring back Dark Magician, which is all about, that's all I can really do, but sure. Only 3,000 left. Nobleman of Extermination. So I, I remember we did this before, right, in the beginning, part one. We can just use this to return our card back. And then it can't destroy it. Ah, oh, you just burned yourself, motherfucker. <laughs> you know what? Yeah, let's activate it. I don't care. Because guess what? We can just activate everything here. So activate Metrical Blast. Now we can just win with burns, because, you know, burn is awesome. Burninate! Yeah, we won using effect damage, which should be an extra bonus for us. Apparently not in this game. Okay, one more time with Wadapon. I might end the video, though. Good, you went sec- God damn it, I wanted to go second. You don't know why I was excited about that. Alright, Dunamis Dark Witch, okay. Um... Activate this. Get rid of you. Um, attack. Oh yeah, it is safe apparently. I'm fine with that. Wait, no, then I'm gonna wait to use mage power. Oh, reflect bounder, okay. Can't really use that, not right now. Wait, who do we have on the in the graveyard? Oh, it's just a magician of faith. I'm gonna have to risk it. Risk the biscuit. It hurt me like a son of a bitch, but at least we got Reflect Bounder out of the way. Oh shit. 
Well, that really blows, man. So we'll activate you. Get rid of you. Get rid of you. Summon you. Activate your ability. Get rid of you. Ah, bottomless trap hole. Go figure. And then we can activate this. Tribute you. Special summon you. And destroy Strong Angel. Ah, it did work! Everything did work out in our favor. I'll set this because I don't think we can really use it on Chaos Sorcerer. Oh yeah, he can lower attack points. That's what Blast Magician does. I think he like burn, but I don't think he actually does burn. There we go. Well, that absolutely just failed me, man. Okay, let's let's have another round. This, this goddamn opponent is starting to piss me off. Okay, no monsters, only face downs. Okay, fine with that. Summon you first of all, and then activate Heavy Storm. Seven Tools of the Bandit and Call the Haunted. Very interesting cards, because I've never seen Seven Tools of the Bandit used on this person. And we'll just attack directly. So that's actually going out nicely. Let's see what you use now. Pot of Greed. Hammer Shot. And nothing overly powerful, I assume. Now I have to be called Haunted. To get me back my card, just in case it's like another Trap Jammer or something. I mean, not Trap Jammer. Seven Tools of Bandit. Trap Jammer is the same ability, just instead of paying a thousand life points, you discard a spell card. Destroy! Ooh, Widespread Ruin. That would have been a good card. Good thing we destroyed it. Attack, my sir. Ah, goddammit, it's hammer shot. No, Potter. Okay. Interesting. I was expecting hammer shot. Don't know which one was technically better, though. Alright, let's see what he uses. Potter Greed, obviously. Okay, nothing super threatening. Uh, put you in face down. And attack whatever this may be. Ah, Sakuratsu armor, okay. Doesn't look like I'm gonna get to use his ability to special summon Dark Magician. Ah, DD Warrior Lady's gonna get rid of our car. God shit me, man. Nice, nice play there, bro. And Oblomit of Crosso, just a. Oh, you are. You are. An ass. I have like nothing I can do. Ooh, we're almost dead, but I do have lightning vortex. Ooh. Owie. Goodbye, Dark Magician. Wait, there's no kind of check. No. Why would I do that, man? I lose because I just didn't draw anything! Okay, I am beating you in this goddamn video. Okay. Okay, let's see what we got here. Nobleman of Crossout. Destroy whatever that face down may be. Marshmallow. Okay, good card to get rid of. We'll start with the library and put you face down. And we'll activate the power stone just in case. And Breaker! Okay, Breaker is not the worst card in the or worst card in the world to have. Oh, 
Aha! Uh -huh. No. So now what I'll do is, now that that's Regeki Break, I just forget that this guy uses Regeki Break because it's such a good card. Called on, but okay. Now we'll just rebuff him. Okay. You can apparently activate his ability twice. But... Royal Magic Library. Okay, so I see how this is going down, bro. Pickaroo! Pickaroo, Pickaroo, you'll help me, right? Little girl, you will help me smote my opponents. Sangin got DD Warrior Lady, okay. Okay, that was interesting. Why would you do that? Alright. Wow, we lost all our Magicians of Faith. Well, I'll use that. Here, we'll feed this card. And then we'll activate Magical Dimension. To get rid of you. Special Summon you. And destroy the library. Because then Dunamis, or Dunamis, Breaker can destroy Dunamis. No, why would I declare? And you know what? We can put one of these on you. So then now you're at 1900, so attack! Oh, that is just excellent. Ah, I can't activate- really? I couldn't activate it there, that's bull. Oh, another one, really? I still have one on here, I still have two. So we'll activate this to destroy that face down, whatever it may be. Death! Ooh, wall revealing light. Good. And now we'll activate this, I guess. And then we'll just attack. What else can we really do? Oh my god, Jesus. No, it's happening all over again, guys. Okay, you know what? Ah, uh, reload. You might actually come in handy. Well, not really, but... Oh. You can at least get Backbreaker. Attack! No. Death to whatever this may be! What a bond. And we win! We actually managed to defeat him. Didn't get very much money from it, but we managed to beat him. He's the only guy we've lost against five times as well. So anyways, let's get some new cards. I know this is a long video, but we deserve some new packs. Right with our 5,000 DP and all? Um, Ancient Sanctuary. Let's see, what do we want? Pharaoh's Servant, Spell Ruler. Uh, how much is the Ancient Sanctuary then? 350, let's, let's just buy a bunch of it. Spend most of our money on it. Oh, that's all we can... Okay, we can continue on, so let's... Let's get some Dark Crisis as well. Oh wait, what am I doing? There we go. Yes. Let's see if we get anything good. I'll just point out the good cards. Um. Yeah, Dez Rook is fine if we want to build an Archfiend deck. 
And Despair from the Dark isn't a bad zombie card. Oh, Pandemonium's good. Ooh, Vile Pawn. And we got the cover card, one of the cover cards, Dark Master Zork. If you like rituals, at least. And nothing really good. Blowback Dragon's in this pack. I didn't think he was. Soul Resurrection's not bad either. Goblin Thief. Atomic Firefly. Wow, that's a crap pack. Uh, oh, we got the cover card. Arc Lord Zerato. Alright, ooh, King of the Swamp. Good if we get elemental heroes in this game. And. Ooh, Draining Shield's good. Moki Moki. The Unhappy Girl. And Legendary Jujutsu Master. And King of the Swamp again. So, what are we at for percentage on these packs? Now, we are currently at 20% of that pack complete and 37. Actually, you know what? We still have enough to buy one of the cheaper packs, right? Um, let's go with Metal Raider. We have enough for one of your packs. So let's let's buy one. Let's see if we get anything good. Gate Guardian. Ooh, we got the cover card. Black Skull Dragon, which actually is just a uh, holographic in this. You know, super rare. Bistro Butcher is not bad. But anyways, if you guys enjoyed this video, remember to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. In the next episode, we'll do some more opponents. Peace out.